Hello, welcome to how to solve this very nice algebra equation x squared minus y squared is equal to 72. We need to find all possible values of x and y where x and y are positive integers it means uh, x is greater than 0 and uh, y is greater than 0. So, by using this uh, algebraic identity a squared minus b squared is equal to a plus b times a minus b. This x squared minus y squared will become x plus y times x minus y is equal to 72. Now, we have uh, two factors at left side. So, we factorize this 72 as a product of two numbers. For this, we see that x plus y, x plus y is greater than x minus y. So, this 72 can be factorized as 72 times 1, 36 times 2, 20. 4 times 3, 18 times 4 and 12 times 6 and 9 times 8. So, we have 6 cases. This is case 1, this is case 2, this is case 3, this is case 4, this is case 5 and this is case 6. First, we solve case 1. In this case, we write this x plus y times x minus y, x plus y times x minus y equal to this 72 times 1, 72 times 1. Now, we write this greater factor x plus y equal to this greater factor 72 x plus y is equal to 72. We write this smaller factor x minus y equal to this one x minus y is equal to 1 and we add these two equations. So, this positive y will be cancelled out with this negative y and this 1x plus this 1x becomes 2 times x is equal to 72 plus 1, 73. And if we divide both sides by 2, this implies that x is equal to 73 over 2. Now, because this number 73 over 2 is not an integer, so no integer solutions can be found from this case. Now, we solve this case to 36 times 2. We write this x plus y times x minus y case 2. We write this x plus y times x minus y x plus y times x minus y equal to this 36 times 2, 36 times 2. Now, we write this uh, greater factor x plus y equal to this greater factor 36 x plus uh, y is equal to 36. We write this smaller factor x minus y equal to this uh, smaller factor 2 x minus y is equal to 2 and we we'll add uh, these two equations. So, this uh, positive y will be cancelled out with this negative y and this 1x plus 1x will become 2 times x is equal to 36 plus 2, 38. And if we divide both sides by 2, this implies that x is equal to 19. Now, we put this value of x 19 in this equation, x plus y is equal to 36. So, this equation will become, in place of x we write 19 plus y is equal to 36 and y is equal to 36 
minus 19 and y is equal to so from this case uh, we get the value of x 19 and value of y 17 now we solve case 3 case 3 is uh, 24 times 3 in case 3 we write uh, this expression x plus uh, y times x minus y equal to 24 times 3 and write this x plus y x plus uh, y equal to this greater factor 24 and we write this x minus y x minus y equal to this uh, smaller factor 3 we will add these two equations. So, this uh, positive y will be cancelled out with this negative y. And this uh, 1x plus 1x will become 2 times x is equal to this uh, 24 plus 3 27. And if we divide both sides by 2, this implies that x is equal to 27 over 2. So, no integer solutions can be found from this case. Now, we solve case 4. Case 4 is 18 times 4. In case 4, we write uh, this expression x plus y times x minus y equal to 18 times 4. Now, we write this x plus y, x plus y equal to this uh, greater factor 18 and we write this x minus y, x minus y equal to this uh, smaller factor 4 and we add uh, these two equations. So, this uh, positive y will be cancelled out with this negative y. And this 1x plus 1x will become 2 times x is equal to 18 plus 4 22. And if we divide both sides by 2, this implies that x is equal to 11. Now, we put this value of x 11 in this equation. Then, this equation will become in place of this x, we write 11 plus y is equal to 18. Y will be equal to 18 minus 11 and y will be equal to 7. So, from this case uh, we get the value of x 11 and value of y 7. Now, we solve case 5. Case 5 is 12 times 6. In case 5, we write this expression x plus y times x minus y equal to 12 times 6. Now, we write this uh, greater factor x plus y, x plus y equal to this uh, greater factor 12. And we write this smaller factor x minus y equal to this smaller factor 6. And we add uh, these two equations. So, this uh, positive y will be cancelled out with this negative y. And this uh, 1 x plus this 1 x will become 2 times x is equal to 12 plus 6, 18. And if we divide both sides by 2, this implies that x is equal to 9. Now, we put this value of x 9 in this equation. Then, this equation will become, in place of this x, we write 9 plus y is equal to 12 and y is equal to 12 minus 9 and y is equal to 3. So, from this case, uh, we get the value of x uh, 9 and value of y 3. 
Now we solve case 6. Case 6 is a 9 times 8. In case 6, we write this expression x plus y times x minus y equal to 9 times 8. Now we write this uh, greater factor x plus y equal to this uh, greater factor 9. And we write this smaller factor x minus y equal to this uh, smaller factor 8. And we add these two equations. So this uh, positive y will be cancelled out with this negative y and this 1x plus 1x will become 2 times x is equal to 9 plus 8 uh, 17. If we divide both sides by 2, this implies that x is equal to 17 over 2. That is not an integer, so no integer solutions can be found from this case. So, the solution set of x, comma y is equal to Nineteen comma seventeen, eleven comma seven, and nine comma three. First pair is nineteen comma seventeen. Second pair is eleven comma seven, and third pair is nine comma three. This is the final answer of this equation.